Hello and welcome back to Canine Wisdom and Insights. In this episode, we embark on an educational journey to explore the diverse universe of dog breeds. We explore the breed categories, shedding light on what sets these groups apart based on their history, physical characteristics, and the roles they were bred to fulfill. Gain insights into the unique contributions of various breeds to human society and the importance of choosing a dog that fits your lifestyle. In this segment, we dive into understanding dog breed classifications. But first, let's answer a fundamental question. Why do these classifications even exist? These classifications have their roots in the diverse roles that dogs have played in human societies throughout history. As humans settled into agricultural communities and later, complex societies, they selectively bred dogs for specific tasks that were essential to their way of life. This led to the emergence of distinct breed groups, each with unique characteristics and abilities suited to their roles. To herd livestock, dogs such as the Border Collie, Australian Shepherd and Shetland Sheepdog were developed for their intelligence, agility and the ability to work closely with human shepherds. Their keen sense of direction and ability to control the movement of other animals made them indispensable in pastoral settings. For hunting, various breeds were created to suit different types of game and hunting styles. Sighthounds like the Greyhound, scent hounds such as the Bloodhound and retrievers like the Labrador Retriever each exhibit traits that were honed for tracking, chasing and retrieving game in varied terrains and conditions. To guard homes, livestock and properties, breeds such as the German Shepherd, Doberman Pinscher and Rottweiler were valued for their strength, courage and loyalty. These dogs were bred to be vigilant protectors, capable of deterring intruders and safeguarding their human families and their assets. For companionship, breeds like the Pug, Cavalier King Charles Spaniel and French Bulldog were developed primarily for their amiable nature and suitability to live closely with humans. These dogs were bred for their gentle demeanor, emotional sensitivity and ability to form strong bonds with their owners, providing comfort and friendship. As a result of these selective breeding practices, a rich tapestry of dog breeds exists today, each with its own unique history and set of traits that originated from the specific purposes they were bred for. This diversity not only highlights the adaptability and versatility of dogs, but also reflects the deep symbiotic relationship that has developed between dogs and humans over thousands of years. Kennel clubs categorize breeds to maintain breed standards, which include specific characteristics and behaviors unique to each breed. Like the American Kennel Club, and the United Kennel Club. These organizations have been instrumental in documenting and standardizing dog breeds and their classifications. This not only helps in organizing dog shows, but also assists prospective dog owners in choosing the right breed for their lifestyle. Discover more about these clubs online for insights, advice and more. Now let's introduce the main categories of dog breeds recognized by these kennel clubs. Working dogs. These are the breeds that are bred to perform specific tasks, such as guarding property, pulling sleds, and performing water rescues. Examples include the Siberian Husky and St. Bernard. Sporting Group. These dogs were bred to assist hunters in the retrieval of game. Breeds such as the Labrador Retriever and the Golden Retriever are part of this group. Toy Breeds. Toy breeds are small companion dogs known for their affectionate nature. Breeds like the Chihuahua and the Pomeranian fall into this category. Non-sporting group. A diverse group. Non-sporting dogs vary greatly in size, personality and overall appearance. The Bulldog and the Dalmatian are prime examples. Herding group. Herding dogs are bred to control the movement of other animals. Think of the Border Collie and the Australian Shepherd. Hounds. This group includes breeds known for their hunting capabilities using sight or scent. The Beagle and the Greyhound are notable members. 
Terriers. Terriers are energetic, determined dogs bred to hunt vermin. The Airedale Terrier and the Scottish Terrier are part of this feisty group. And finally, the miscellaneous category, which includes breeds that are still in the process of gaining full recognition by some kennel clubs. Understanding these classifications is just the beginning. Each breed carries a rich history and a set of characteristics that make them uniquely suited to their traditional roles, whether that's companionship, protection, or work. On future episodes of Canine Wisdom and Insights, we'll uncover the chapters of their history, celebrating their legacy and the love we share for dogs. Stay with us as we dive into decoding dog behavior, essential dog care tips, basic training commands, and more. Thanks for joining us on Canine Wisdom and Insights. Until next time, keep those tails wagging.